All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Lawnmower Simulator. This time, I am going to complete this yard. The next video that I do will be a... Probably a power wash simulator video. I was told that was really good. And that it was relaxing as well. So... I think that's going to be next. It was recommended. I'm kind of excited to play that too. I've wanted to for a long time. For those of you guys that don't know, I actually, uh, when I'm not doing stuff like this, I, I build bridges for a living. So, this is kind of a de stress situation. I can't remember how to get off of my my mower. Well, crap. Q. Okay. Yeah, I know how to sprint. That's pretty well the same as any other game. How do I pull out my trimmer, though? Because that'd be cool. Oh. Never mind. It's just a me issue. That way I'm not destroying any flowers. Anything like that. I don't have to get insanely close to any of it. Just got to cut. I'm honestly about ready for this time of year. Where I can actually be doing this to my own lawn. It's one of the few things that I like doing. I like making sure my lawn's nice and tidy. and You know, because I don't want it, I don't want it to look... Well, bad. Obviously, I do a better job at that. Than I do in the game. Obviously, I've messed up and missed a lot. What do you guys think? Should I do more videos like this? You think it'd be a good, relaxing thing? I think it would help me work on my commentary too, because I don't really talk too much. I've never really figured out how to do that and not feel weird about it. That's been my issue. 
but I always feel weird about it, like I'm just having some sort of like mental break or something. Not or overloaded. That's no good, I guess. Those things aren't getting fucked, aren't getting chopped down. Oh, never mind. Of course, I spoke it into existence. Now look. All sorts of issues. Man, I can't believe I did, well, I can believe I did that. To be honest here. I'm not exactly Captain Finesse. My boss at work likes to describe me as a, uh, how, how does he say, damn it, a bull in a china shop. Me and the other guy that I work with because we just, we're not very good at the finesse part of our job. Which, this is probably a controller game anyway. Playing it on mouse keyboard, probably making it a lot harder on myself than I need it to be. I don't know, I just feel a little more comfortable with mouse and keyboard nowadays. I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't have any issue with the controller, other than it just feels weird now. That's all I used to play, I used to play Xbox, and things like that. Then I let some friends talk me into a bad decision, and now I got a PC. Way too expensive. Makes you wonder what kind of uh, ring I'm using. So I've hit everything that I shouldn't hit. Man, there's something just satisfying about this. Uh, I love it. You guys know of any other relaxing games? Other than the power wash simulator that I said I was going to try and do next. Let me know in the comments. That could be a lot. It'd be nice for me. And I can put them on, you know, do some more videos, hang out with you guys a little bit more. I need to find a good editor, too. I'm not too good at that myself. So it just I feel like it puts out subpar product when I when I try and do it. So if you guys know anybody, or you yourselves are looking, let me know. I'd uh, really like to hear from you know somebody about it. Can I put this back? Yes. Let's get it. What is that? 
Yep, why does I? Why do I have to? Now we're cooking. Oh, yes. Sorry. I quit talking. I just got into it. It just really sucked me in. I remember why. I want to play this game for as long as I have. Even though I, I understand it's not very old. But... I wanted to play it when it first came out, but none of my friends were ever in anything like this, so it's kind of why I decided to do like a casual solo let's play. See if I could, you know, get anywhere with it and see if it was worth it. I'm not usually one that plays many games by myself, because I get lonely and, and it seems like the game isn't as fun. So this is all right. I like this a lot. Wish I had a riding mower in real life, though. Man, that would make things easier. Well, I don't know if it would. My new house. Kind of just... Well, new to me house. I got some hills that I'd really about hate to, uh... To mow. I'm gonna hate mowing them. But I'm excited at the same time. I finally get to actually take pride in my lawn. It's not some, not something that's already been destroyed by somebody else that I can't 
fix. That was the issue with my my old house. Was that it looked like somebody had taken and drove their vehicle in the lawn a lot and made it made it really hard. And then there was a a spot in the back that it, I don't know if it just never got sunlight or what, but the seed that was back there never sprouted. So I had to, uh, to go and get some actual, like, low stuff that was good for, like, low levels of sunlight. And it, it actually ended up flourishing. Now we're cooking. Now we're getting there. About halfway done. A little over halfway done. Man. Actually going a lot quicker than I thought. I wonder if you can do the zigzag pattern. Like this game. This one spot here has been bugging me. That one strip there that I've missed. Oh yeah. Man, I'm loving this. Trying to make it reckon I go around it a little bit easier. Maybe then it won't look as bad. Probably will though. It's fine, I guess. I need to really up my uh, my thumbnail game too. That's pretty bad too, or as well, as you guys can tell. I'm not too artistic anymore. Everything's more like numbers and things like that. I'm not so much being creative. Well, this is how it's supposed to be. It needs to be like this. Which is nice to some degree, I guess, but it'd just be... I don't know. Sometimes being able to be creative would be pretty... But what do you guys think? Is the uh, the new content worth it? Is the solo stuff better than the stuff that I put out with my friends? If so, go ahead. Let me know. Because, I mean, I'm not 
completely against doing this either. You know, obviously I'd still do things with my friends, but I put that on my channel as well. But it's just sometimes things like this. I'd rather play things like this a lot of times. There's only so much you can rage at something like Call of Duty and it'd be fun still. And I've pretty well reached my limit. Especially trying to grind for all the camos. That makes it not fun for me at all. As, it, it seems like to me as soon as I put some sort of something like that in place where I was doing it for something, it made the game not fun to me anymore. I think back when I was just playing it just to play it, it was a lot more fun. At least to me. What I threw in on my on myself, I said I was gonna get all the camos unlocked for all the guns this time and I mean, I'm not doing terrible, it's just, it's not good for me. I feel like it's bad for my mental health, and that's why something like this is great. Because I don't want to be angry, especially not at a game. You know, because playing games is something that I love to do, why would I want to be mad while I'm doing it? If, if that makes sense, and I think it does, <clears throat> I, at least I hope it does. Oh yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we are almost done with this lawn. Man. I love it. I don't really think I'd like all the tire tracks, though. Look at that. No, it's not. Now, now it looks better to me. Yeah, just leave that on the client's lawn. I'm sure that'd be fine. Maybe they're not gonna care. It's okay. Oh, yeah. fill my tanks before the next I don't know if that's something that I'm, I should actually be concerned with or not but man look at that
Look at that. Vehicle's damaged. Heck, that still looks brand new. Uh-oh. I wish I could customize it, though, and change colors. That'd be all right. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I did. It was a lot of fun. It was really relaxing. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next one.